I appreciate you joining. I hope that you are doing well. Yopan Holly, the only caffeine source native to the U.S., America's Forgotten Tea Plant. Did you know that there is a caffeinated plant native to North America? Previously viewed as a weed by farmers, Yopan Holly is a plant that can be dried and turned into a tea. Yopan Holly is an evergreen shrub or small tree native to the southeastern states from Texas to Virginia and is a close cousin of the South American yerba mate. The plant's leaves contain around 1% caffeine, similar to the caffeine content of yerba mate, but the taste may be even better. Especially when it's roasted, yopan has a sweeter or more pleasant taste than yerba mate. Yopan tea has a deliciously robust flavor and still packs in health benefits similar to those of green tea or yerba mate. Yopan tea has been drunk in pockets across the American South for hundreds of years and was used medicinally by Native Americans. Indian tribes used it for both recreation and ceremony. Early settlers knew the tea as the black drink. During the Civil War, Southerners substituted Yopan Holly tea for coffee and black tea. The modern commercialization of Yopan Holly has only begun in the last few years. The leaves have been used to treat high blood pressure, fever, rheumatism, and digestive issues. Holly leaf extract is sometimes used to combat jaundice, dizziness, and emotional problems. The rich content of caffeine makes the Yopan tea a strong heart stimulant. Yopan is almost equal to yerba mate in caffeine and antioxidant content. Like coffee and tea, Yopan is rich in polyphenols. According to a study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, there is a strong case for polyphenols in the prevention of degenerative diseases, particularly cardiovascular diseases and cancers. Further, a 2011 study has demonstrated the specific polyphenols found in Yopan tea to have anti-inflammatory and chemopreventive effects. The high content of antioxidants make it perfect for boosting your metabolism. Yopan holly is great for improving the way your body burns fat, and it is recommended for people who want to lose weight. One study also demonstrated that the antioxidant levels of Yopan tea are not affected by a change in packaging or storage. Leaves and stems of Yopan holly may be used fresh, dried, or roasted, and stored like any dried herbal tea. They are traditionally parched to a dark brown over a fire. The leaves may also be parched in the oven or on the stovetop at 350 to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. A simple tea is brewed by steeping just a few leaves in a cup of hot water for a few minutes and then straining out the leaves. Parching the leaves infuses a smoky flavor similar to yerba mate. Not all hollies are safe for consumption, so it's important to make positive identification, as is the case with any wild edible. You can also purchase the tea online. It is advisable to not overuse Yopan Holly, as it has a high content of caffeine. Two cups a day are perfectly normal, but overuse will lead to problems similar to coffee overuse. Thank you for watching. Good day and good health.